Hi. Hi. I forgot my other bag. All right. I'm very sorry about the surreal but nice comment. Disaster. That's OK. I thought the apricot and honey thing was the real low point. Yeah. Whoops, the daisies. Um. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> Nothing. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. You said whoopsie daisies. No one says. Whoopsie daisies, do they? I mean, unless there are... is no unless, because no one has said whoopsie daisies for what fifty years, and even then it was um, it was just little girls with blonde ringlets. Exactly. Right. So here we go again. Whoa! Whoa! Whoopsie daisies. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, it's a, it's a disease. It's a clinical thing. I'm uh, taking pills and having injections. I'm told it won't last long. So. Okay. Stand aside. I don't think that's a good idea. Mm. Really, it's quite um, tricky. Anna. Anna, don't. It's harder than it. No, it's not. It's easy. What? Come on, Flopsy. Right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, God, this, this could be very unpleasant. Ay, bugger, bugger. Now, what in the world in this garden could make that ordeal worthwhile? It's amazing how you can speak right to my heart. Nice garden. Without oh, please, sod off. Okay. No, 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 no. Wait, I thought you were um, someone else. I thought you were Spike. I'm thrilled that you're not. Strike me as well surreal. I'm allowed to see you naked. You and every person in this country. Gordy, I'm sorry. What is it about men and nudity, hmm? Particularly breasts. How can you be so interested in them? Well. No, but seriously, 
They're just breasts. Every second person in the world has them. Well, more than that, actually, when you think about it. You know, Meatloaf has a very nice pair. <laughs> but they're... they're odd-looking. They're for milk. Your mother has them. You've seen a thousand of them. What's all the fuss about? Actually, I can't think what it is, really. Let me just have a quick look. No, no, beats me. <laughs> oh. Rita Hayworth used to say, they go to bed with Gilda, they wake up with me. Who was Gilda? Her most famous part. Men went to bed with the dream and they didn't like it when they woke up with reality. You feel that way? You are lovelier this morning than you have ever been. I live in Notting Hill. You live in Beverly Hills. Everyone in the world knows who you are. My mother has trouble remembering my name. Fine. Fine. Good decision. Good decision. The fame thing isn't really real, you know. And don't forget, I'm also just a girl standing in front of a boy asking him to love her. Yeah, uh, the last time you were here, there were some fairly graphic photographs taken of you with uh, a young English guy. So, uh, what happened there? He was just a friend. We're still friends, I think. Right. Um, yes, gentleman in the pink shirt. Yes. Miss Scott, are there any circumstances in which uh, the two of you might be more than just good friends? I hoped there would be, but no, I'm assured there aren't. But what would you say Mama, if... I'm oh. sorry. Just the one question, please. No, it's all right. You were saying? I was just wondering if uh, it turned out that this person... Uh, Thacker. His name was Thacker. Thanks, thanks. <laughs> just wondered whether if Mr. Thacker realized he'd been uh, a daft prick. <laughs> and got down on his knees and begged you to reconsider whether you would, in fact, then reconsider. Yes, I believe I would. That's very good news. Um, the readers of Horse and Hound will be absolutely delighted. <laughs> right. Uh, Dominic, if you'd like to ask your question again... Yeah? Anna, how long are you intending to stay here in Britain? Indefinitely. I have to pay. She saw what happened? So sick. It was good. Maybe the children are the dreams. Maybe a hundred different things within the measure of a day. Dream.